G'day and welcome back for more assertive acquisitions and I think we're clear of those drones. There's only one yeah. left. Where'd they go? I'm guessing they either crashed or ran out of fuel and returned to base. Mm. Hey, there's still that fruit fly at that rack. Well, there were three there before and there's only one left now, which makes me think we're in the clear for the moment. But it also makes me aware that we possibly want to put in more of these installations around the rim of our crater. Yeah, possibly, yeah. And maybe even focus a bit on that. Yeah. Maybe. I was going to quickly swap out uh, the guns on my rover because I want to try something that uses a bit less ammo. <laughs> yeah, you. I still don't understand why yours is using up so much more than mine. It's possibly because I turn the rotation speed down, so it's missing more often. Oh, yeah, possibly. I also, I think, narrowed my angle down. Um, let me check. So I'd set mine to... Where is custom turret controller? Uh, mine's set to an angle deviation of 2.87. And velocities of 5. What's yours at? Mm. Um, what are my settings at? Been so long. <laughs> Wait, why have I got a third custom current control on the grid that's owned by you and it isn't doing anything? Oh, uh, no, that's because no, it's not on the grid. It's, it's, no, it's because <laughs> I'm connected to the base. Um, I've got 2.5, 2.5, an angle deviation of 5. Yeah, so I've got a narrower angle deviation. <laughs> Uh, mm. faster movement speed. Yeah. So I set it to 5 and 2.8-ish. I was going to say, we probably don't want to use assault cannons. Yeah, plus they're kind of long compared to the... <laughs> I find it difficult to drive out of the... I mean, use whatever weapons you want. I'm... But I don't think we've got any particular reason Fuel not low. to use anything except for if we run out of ammo. Is that the Gatling guns like punch a bit? They do. So... There are two ways to look at it. You've got more punch per bullet or more punch per second. Gatling, more punch per second. Assault cannons, more punch per bullet. Um, so uh, if you're hitting with cannons. every bullet... Um, not uh, assault cannons. Assault cannons are the one with the longer range. Oh. I know, the, it's confusing. The, the What are the other ones? Auto cannon. Auto cannon. Auto cannon has the same range as the Gatling gun, but it's basically the lower fire rate but higher damage. Yeah. And the weapon is also a block longer, I think. Well, yeah. assault assault cannons kind of also fit under that because they they yes they have the greater range, which is helpful, absolutely. But their fire rate is so low that Gatling still, I'm pretty sure, outperform them against a small, fast-moving target. Because I'm pretty sure the most of the, some of the drones have been using auto cannons, haven't they? Or is they assault cannons? I think they're all assault. Hmm. I think. They seem pretty effective. <laughs> no, they're all auto cannons. They're all auto cannons. I didn't put assault cannons on anything. I did, however, take damage to all sorts of random blocks on my rover. So what are you going to do about your lack of ability to fly in this environment with the setup that we have? Or are you just thinking that that was just a learning curve and you'll be fine next um, time? I don't know. Because <laughs> I, I mean, kind of want to make like a fighter thing. I mean, yeah, eventually. I so one of the reasons I quite like uh, oh. rovers as attack vehicles, or things that can be rovers as attack vehicles, is that if you're in a fighter and you lose thrust, you're done. You lose the mm. whole craft. And you whereas, can't really, like, bring stuff back, whereas you can with the rover. Well, yeah, but it's more just the fact that you are you really are a glass cannon. As soon as you break, you shatter. Whereas with a, with a rover, you've got that bit of resilience. You've got that bit of ability to stay in the fight even after taking serious damage. Yeah. Like, look, you limped back from the base with only four wheels actually intact. Yes. And a fifth yes. under construction. Mm. Oh yes, and we had a brilliant suggestion on what to do with that dead end spot, didn't we? We did. I will make it a bathroom. I think I'm going to 
abandon the dreams of a solar tower. It keeps getting blown up. It really does. It's kind of a shame we can't hide it under glass or something. Yeah, it is. The base took a fair bit of damage. There's quite a few dented things. Oh, that's right. The underbiter got smashed. What? Oh, yeah. Oh, I forgot about that. Fuel. Um, at least we did. Well, you defeated the listing post. I uh, distracted the drone. <laughs> One of them. I still killed another two. That's true. Actually, was it just the cockpit that got smashed? Is the rest of it fine? They would almost be worth having the solar panels at like ground level, considering how high the sides of like the sides of these craters are pretty low. You're just thinking you, we could have a couple of flat panels, even even if they were just flat panels on the roof, they'd probably last better than having them on a rotor. Yeah, just have them. Just not bother with the tracking array. Pretty much. Because the only time the sun really goes down is when it goes behind the gas giant. Yeah, I I was thinking I might just set us up for hydrogen. Oh, well, that. Yeah. Or are you getting lost in the base? Perfect. The plans are working. Okay, there's something else still broken in here. What is still broken in here? Mm. Where is that smoke coming from? The mystery smoke is not good. No. It's very uh, annoying. Did you put a projector on that? And probably not. No, I did not. You put one on your rover, I think. Yeah, I wasn't expecting this to get smashed up. It's a mining vehicle. Yeah, this base tends to get, only get damaged when we're not here. <laughs> yeah, it's irritating. <laughs> we stayed here, it'll be fine. <laughs> Alright, the conveyor connecting to my... Um, oh yeah, were you going to put a beacon on that? Because we're putting beacons on basically everything. Uh, I wasn't too worried about this. What I was probably going to focus some time on was putting a roof over this so that it doesn't get shot again. Ah, yes. I just don't like how this looks now. What'd you do? Like, trying to figure out where to move the turret. Just get the thing it's not going to look right no matter where I put it. I... So, I think your best approach here would be to build the front end, imagining the turret already in it. So, instead of having your ramp here... Put the ramp further out, build the front, the fronting of it, with conveyor running up, across, Actually, and then a turret, and then across, and then another turret. Yeah, so I was thinking a pair of turrets could, on the front of it. Rather than running at the floor, I can yeah. run across the roof, uh, down the middle. Well, I'm not even thinking that. Fuel I'm just, critical. but yeah, you could do that as well. I'm just thinking if you put an end cap on this, something that's decoratively attached to the front that isn't made out of beams then you'll have room to play with that you can put the conveyors into because you could even make the end cap out of conveyors hmm. and then put a pair of turrets on there instead of just the one because I think yeah you can fit two turrets on there quite easily at some point we'll make this thing airtight <laughs> mm, will we though <laughs> um, well <laughs> I think it's like I mentioned before, have like the little airtight middle bit and then have everything else sort of outside, more open. Just more... much doubt coming from my direction that we'll actually get to that point. I'm gonna try to. What, you think we'll get blown up before then? No, I just think we'll keep adding stuff and never quite get it done. Once we've got, once we've got power generation, once we've got now that we've got enough refinery, once we've got enough storage, all those sorts of things. Once all that's in place, um, then it shouldn't take, shouldn't be too hard to then pressurize it. But it's just, I don't think it'll happen before that happens. That gets stuff sorted. Mm. Oh yeah, we're not producing more animal mode because we're out of iron. Oh, are we out of iron. Uh, yes. Oh. Crap! I'm gonna have to go mine some. Now I want to change. I'm still the smoking. Entire... I'm not smoking. Now I'm like, I want to change this entire conveyor layout in the garage just to make it look better. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> I'm going to get this iron and then I'm going to the listening post and stealing its battery. 
Well, actually, yeah, because we currently haven't got any power output, have we? Nope. Well, were you going to build a lifter to carry your rover nearer to battle and then just park nearby? Slash fly back home? Mm, possibly, but it seems a bit... Uh, it seems like a daft idea. I could almost have like a little landing pad on the back of the rover for like a little fighter. Well, except that the reason we were flying was so that the thing that had wheels could get over bad terrain. Well, I don't think small grid would really work. I mean, heck, make a fighter that can also carry the rover. <laughs> you can just dock it on the back when you're not using it. Uh, that should be the ice. I mean, the iron delivered. That'll get us through a little Thanks. bit. And where's that base at? Let's go. And hope I don't get anything triggered. <laughs> yes, from all your flying around. <laughs> well, just from getting too close to one of these other bases, because some of them are pretty close. Mm. I wonder how much of the listing post I can lift up. Pick it up with the flying <laughs> ship. I've got a fair bit of extra, extra power. Mm. Could work. Let me give it a go. Doomed. <laughs> That'd be fine. Always fine right up until it isn't. <laughs> I mean, the listening post is pretty big, so I might... Like, if I can't lift the whole thing up, I might just try and grab a section. Ah. Yeah. Alright, I'm locked. Oh my gosh, I can carry the whole thing. What? <laughs> <laughs> it sounds incredibly... Gotta love moon gravity. Uh, just be very careful if you're landing back at base. Yep. Alright, I'm bringing the whole thing. It's on its way. Oh dear. Okay, this might be the point where I want to turn off my reverse thrusters. I've been lazy and not done it. I'll do it now. Okay, I've got just under 4Ks to travel. I've got 73% fuel. Hopefully I don't run out, because if I do, yeah, I'm going to have to drop much? this base in the middle of nowhere. 71%. Where should we put this? Um... Yeah, we do need like a, we need like almost like a little platform thing we can put stuff on. Um, I suppose just don't, More... just don't drop it on me. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the pit right next to the base. <laughs> no, I'm, want I'm, to hide it. I'm meaning to attach it to our base. Um, hmm. Let's stick it up the top, actually. We've kind of already got the garage. I mean. We could extend out past where you put the miner. Yeah, perhaps. Ooh, okay. While my thrusters can handle this, my gyros, not so much. Yeah, I was going to say, you're not going to have much. Was this episode sponsored by the letter X? <laughs> <laughs> yep. Uh, just, ooh, this is, I'm terrified you're going to drop this into the base. This does not like, not look like it should work. <laughs> <laughs> this is like watching the smallest tugboat like moving around a super tanker. <laughs> and you are basically touching the ground. Well, I think when you drop it, it might roll a bit. So you might not get clear. <laughs> okay. There we good. go. We brought. We finally got some. We finally acquired something. So what? This is our. Um, it's our living quarters. Our living quarters. <laughs> Uh, alright, was there anything? I didn't even check what was on board here. Ooh. Ammunition. Of a few different types. Some bullets. Some space credits. What? Why is this? Huh? Oh, is it showing yellow? I didn't know T-junctions did that. So, um, the... You know how the little lights tell you whether the, um, conveyor thing's complete? It'll be yep. green. Uh, apparently T-junctions will make the end appear yellow even though it is connected to the rest of it. I know that. Like, huh? you can see it's green here and it's connected here and it shows as yellow even though it's got a connection back to the... That's because this one's missing. What? Why is... Uh, why is that one missing? <laughs> Yay, it's green now. <laughs> Problem solved. Uh -huh. Bug report undone. Oh, <laughs> uh, well. Okay, I'm going to try and connect this thing up. Ooh, connections. Let's see if it uh, looks ridiculous where I put it. It's like, we don't need we don't need to build a living module, we'll just steal it. Yep. 
And it's a communications module too. Double duty, good. Um, now to steal all those auto cannon magazines so I can load up my... Oh, I'm going to have to rename my rover again, aren't I? Wait, do auto cannons not... No, no, they fit. You, you don't want to call it the dad anymore? No, I'll just probably call it... I think it's 2.0. Did just sorry. freeze for you for a second? Game pause connection problem? Uh... It's not happy about this Merce block. <laughs> what did you do? You crashed... Oh, no, we're back. Oh, I oh, just... It's... Oh, is it because of the grid updating? Yeah, that was that was intense. I I had a, like a, a view of the entire solar system for a second. So I suggest we uh, get some more permanent attachment points so we can get rid of that merge block. <laughs> yeah, it'll be fine. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, because I was going to say, you could... Uh, yeah, like, with the way it's set up, you could widen the entrance. Yeah. Uh, to connect it up to the thing. That's yep. convenient. That's kind of the plan. I need to go get more iron again, don't I? Probably, yeah. Fine, I'll do it. I'm half tempted to try and build a Underbiter 2 that's even bigger. Ooh, so you're going like proper... Underbiter 2, the uppercut. Um, We're going to need a museum for all your different... <laughs> <laughs> so I'm now up to version 3.0 of the double armoured duck. Because it was 2.0. <laughs> so wait, I thought it was double because it was that was the version two. No, because it's double. Originally it was double armored because it had guns on each side. Uh -huh. and then it became double armored because I made heavy armored, and now it's the jumping uh, double armored because it can fly sort of. Oh, so it's JD now. Yeah, or J Dad. <laughs> <laughs> All right, J Dad. Yep, we'll call it the J Dad. Yes, he's turning into a hip-hop artist. Or a dad that's really trying hard not to be one. Um, I swear I'm cool! I was going to say, is it worth welding up the floor in the garage? Not yet, no. No. Okay, I will just uh, repark my rover. I mean, you could help cleaning up the scraps that are on top of your roof of your garage. I thought I did. Oh yeah, I got rid of one of the soul power on top of it. Quite different. There were two more up there. Oh. <laughs> right, goodbye, solar thingy. Our base isn't really a listening post, though, it says. Though we haven't named it. Uh. I actually did name it Crater Base. <laughs> oh, didn't I see some someone point? Someone suggested a uh, very interesting name? Oh, they did. What was it? Uh, Agitation Station. Oh, yep. Because yep. the. On the moon, they landed at Tranquility Base. Yep. Agitation and Station it is. Yes, and we've not had Tranquility. <laughs> Your rover's intact. My rover's yeah. intact. It we is. We could go deal with some of the, some more of these bases that are around us so that we can then start working on some fighters to try and get one of the ships that goes overhead. Oh, there's a HAB module. Yep. One kilometers away. And that terrain is a bit kinder over that way. <laughs> Shall we do it? Uh, yep. You're happy with your the state of your rover? It's it's good yeah, to go. Yeah, I might queue up a little bit extra ammo for it. Right, and I just realised there are actually some blocks missing from the front of my turret. Uh, oh, no! Well, someone's already queued a whole bunch of auto cannon ammo. Oh, the auto craft has probably done it. Yep. But disconnect my rover from the thing, because otherwise it will suck all the components back. <laughs> Or you could just set it up and say locked on the things you don't want stolen. Uh, that sounds complicated. <laughs> Says the guy who comes up with thousands of MES mods. Oh, that's easy. <laughs> Fuel. Is my most popular one is literally just blowing up a bunch of stuff and sticking it in the ground. <laughs> Fuel. Wait, so what? Did, didn't you say you have a lower angle deviation? Than me on custom turret controls. Yeah, I, I got have... it down to like 2.8. Ah, maybe I should do that. Because I've got on the deep, I think default's 5, which. Yeah, it's a bit much. We'll try 2.5. Alright. Oh, yeah, uh, are we going to stick some solar panels somewhere so this base has power production again? Nah, it's fine because we brought that battery, it should have power for a while. Actually, we could. Let me just go uh... check. Yeah, I was going to say, the um, module's not really large enough for solar panels. 
Although, we could replace the antenna dish. Although, because no. at least then... Well, because at least then if it gets blown up, it's not the... It doesn't fall on our main bit of our base. <laughs> There's that, but no. I want the, I want the antenna dish. Um, oh, okay, so we need to do another one and put the uh, replace yeah. that dish with it. <laughs> it's, so. got, it's got five hours of power. We'll be fine. Fine. <laughs> okay. Need the extra bottles when we go on these epic journeys. Oh, yeah. Oxygen bottle, hydrogen bottle. They all appear to be filled. Rifle has ammo, although I haven't really ended up using. No, which has been nice. It has. Um, setting, uh, I don't need to set targeting. Oh, dang it, third person looking at my own decapitated head. <laughs> Bring just a few building materials. Oh, yeah, I've, also, yeah I've still got 50% hydrogen, I'll be fine. Alrighty, so we're going. You want to go after the hab module? Do we uh, want to take out yeah. the storage on our way there? I think possibly. I think we possibly want to do one thing at a time because we have a problem of us going to multiple things and then drones coming and blowing up the stuff behind us. Well, yeah, but that, so then we should probably go for the storage rather than the hab module because the storage is closer and I don't think we can get past it without aggravating it. Mm, true. That's Let's where go. I was kind of coming from. What's the plan of attack here? The train looks pretty Full frontal! So we've got the person with many Gatling guns versus a person with... I will remember that it's auto cannons and not assault cannons. No, yeah, <laughs> I won't. <laughs> I honestly especially, won't. Especially confusing as there isn't a large grid turret version of these. There's only a small grid one. Yeah. Oh, that's, oh, that's a hole! Third person is useful sometimes. <laughs> It's alright, I got my thrusters on and I'm just gonna glide over. Oh yeah. <laughs> Whee! And release. Nope, not yet. That's another crater. <laughs> and eventually you end up flying into the base. And now we release. Actually, it's really good terrain on this, past this side. Hmm. By moon yeah. standards, <laughs> anyway. I like how the direction we went last was the one with the worst terrain by far. Hmm. We haven't seen any drones yet. We're quite close. Yeah, is something broken? I hope not. Uh, I don't think so. I don't know. Maybe they're um, on break. <laughs> oh. There's a space wasp. Yeah, we, we got excited too soon. <laughs> just um, decided to wait until we thought they weren't sending any help. Yep. I see it. Uh, is that, that's going to head to one of our other racks, potentially. It's almost directly above one. Uh, I suppose we could sneak in and get this base while it's distracted. I think it's coming towards us with how quickly it's moving. I don't know. There's a... Mm, potentially. Uh, where's this base? I'm 900 metres away. We can get quite a lot closer. Oh, yeah. If you... Yeah, if we head along this ridge line. Yeah. Yeah, the space wasp's coming for us. It's two k's out. There's another one inbound. Oh, uh, yep, we're picking up targets on the base. Oh, 1.5 kilometers. The space wasp. Uh, yeah, you don't go out from behind that hill. Space wasp is within it's range. Almost here. Ugh. Yes. <laughs> the sound. Much better. The sound is good, isn't it? Oh, and the guns can shoot over each other if it's on the side. That's handy. Ooh. You're taking fire. I'm dodging. <laughs> oh, that looks beautiful. Why does it take so much to destroy it? Oh, bits are falling off it. Why is it shooting the bits? Because I've set it to target propulsion. Hey. Here you go. Next one's about to get here. I feel like this is using a lot of ammo. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, it does. Am I going to have to add a fourth wheel just so I can stick more cargo containers to fit more ammo? I had a suggestion on my hinge that I need to try and fix. Yeah, it's uh, new for once. Oh. Why, why was that one so easy? I don't know. <laughs> um, how are we going to tackle all this space? Where are the guns? I think let's, there's a gun on top. Let's just go. Let's just go. Switch to target Seriously, weapons. I, th I think your go. guns might be better just because they do less collateral damage. We can loot more stuff. It's fine. Alright, I'm going in. I'm going in. I'm going in. I'm going in. Taking fire. It's 
Scatling on top. Yeah. Oh, fruit. Two fruit flies. That uh, whatever. Fruit fly and fire fly incoming. Oh, I took some serious damage. Are you helping or what are you doing? Yeah, I'm helping. Ooh. My guns are having a slightly interesting effect on the. Ow. I, I can actually shoot the turret because we're in position. Hang on. I'm trying to get better. Yeah. There you go. Turret's down. Oh, there's a little turret underneath. Doesn't matter. Alright, I think we're good. Uh, except for those fruit flies are incoming. Yeah, switch the target also, propulsion. Yeah, we also might want to. Oh, actually, yeah. Where are they? Firefly is almost here. Fruit fly. Uh, oh, there's a firefly at our base as well. There is? Yeah. Ooh. Ow! Goodbye. Uh, fruit fly at 2.5 kilometers. Uh, yep, they're at, it's at agitation station. All right, fruit fly's almost here. Fruit fly is still at the base. That's slightly like worrying. Better not have blown up my garage after I just built it. <laughs> what the heck? Flying up? What's the drone doing? It's trying to get... <laughs> it's not satisfied with how high it is that Barbara wants to get Oh, it's dive bomb! Watch out! Ooh, that was close! Do you think we shot the propulsion or it just... Yeah, I bombed? think so. Um, the drone's still a base. Hmm. Hopefully well, it's just like falling in a crater somewhere where it can't be shot. How mm. about with this base here, let's just destroy the remote and not take over control. Let's just destroy the AI module and that's it. Hmm. Then come back for it later. Yeah. Because then it's not a big distraction, although it does appear to have become neutral. I think we took out the... Uh, thing. yeah. Uh, there's... A moderate amount of ammo on here. Oh! oh! Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There's what? I'm not telling you. What? I also can't get through this. What are you looking for? Ha! Ah! What? I got the plushie. What? <laughs> there was a plushie here. Oh, really? <laughs> um, oh, there, there is quite a bit of ammo in these guns. Yeah, there is. We can come back for this. Let's let's go um, do what we were planning on doing. What were we planning on doing? Uh, was it the hab module? Yep. Anyway, I got a GPS. Ah, oh, no, it's still broadcasting, isn't it? Uh, yeah, unless there's something in there with some motors in it. So uh, I can repair that the, gun. The heat, the heat vent has motors. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I don't need computers from something. Um, isn't there LCD screens? Oh, Ooh, the, the lockers have else. computers. Hey, what's this debris out here? Oh, bits of a drone, which aren't really worth anything. Dang proprietary ion thrusters. What does mean? As long as the agitation station is still broadcasting, things should be good. Oh, yeah, good point. That is that is a nice reassuring sign we have. I can't wait for it to, us to just randomly find platinum while <laughs> not looking for it. Oh, have you got your ore detector on? Uh, yeah. Zoom, I, like, zoom. I like how now I'm being super cautious using my thrusters. <laughs> well, lessons learned on all that, I suppose. Mm. And this is just going on epic journey. <laughs> well, there's a crater. You can go across it this way. Like, I've just got my dampeners on and I'm turning my thruster on and off to glide. Hmm. Gives a bit more of a predictable control. Because I'm just main, I'm just mainly, I'm only like driving, uh, not driving. I'm only flying when I really have to. <laughs> I've only used up 27% uh, of my fuel. Only. <laughs> what? That's I'm... only more than a quarter. Yeah, but we've done sort of half of our mission. I suppose so. My concern always with flying is. Flying into Firefly inbound. Yep. Uh, where is it? Oh, is it really going to go and shoot the thing we just captured? No. Well, unless they go and shoot stuff owned. It, actually, it might go for our base. But I think it's closer to the base than us. It is? Yeah. Uh... It's doing something and it's going away from me. 
that firefight? Yeah, it's heading for the base, I think. Not heading towards me. Uh, where are you? I am a One kilometer. Yeah. Oh, right now we're Yahoo's. Mm-hmm. I am 600 meters from the HAB module. Yep. I am pretty much the same distance behind you as I was before. Yep. Oh, fruit fly ahead of us. Yep. The other one is... It is going to the wreck we just captured. Arr! <sighs> this is the problem. That drone just disappeared. Which one? The fruit fly that was near me just disappeared. No, it's not. I can see it. It's 1.5 kilometers away. Wait, where are you? You've disappeared. Yeah, my I can't move my rover. Uh, I can't see you. Where are you? Oh, wait, no, I can see you, but you're not broadcasting. Have you went out of power? No. Oh, I'm actually pretty low on power as well. I've only got five minutes when I'm at, um, driving max speed. Oh, I am out of power. Uh oh. Oh! Uh. No! Hang on. I'm always in range. I, I must say that I must say that gun sounds like someone beatboxing. Come on! No, it smashed my robot. No. Shoot it down! You blow. Looks like I've got to get closer. You <laughs> good. Oh, there we go. Bit... I think you got its tar uh, it's gone. Yay! Um, how much power do you have? Uh, when I'm at, I've got five minutes when I'm uh, maxing out my, like accelerating at maximum speed. Ow! You just? No, you didn't die. No, I didn't. <laughs> I'm also nearly out of ammo. This is um, really becoming a problem. <laughs> keep doing this. Yeah, I don't. I don't know how you keep running out of ammo. Because I'm just using more. <laughs> but how? I'm Do shooting to, as I, much as you are. I have to just keep extending. Maybe I'm just underestimating how much I need to chuck in when I leave. Yeah. Um. um so. Uh, given, well, yeah. Given I'm out what of power. Uh, and I can't re-give you any because then I'd be out of power. Shall we attempt to assault this base and try and get its battery, and use it for power? Oh, what's like if build we can a build a yeah. connector on the base and. Um, like, because you haven't got I, enough power to get home if you've got five minutes. Uh, there's no gun facing us because it's not shooting at me. Oh, yes, there is. There's an interior turret. Uh, oh, hang on. Ow. Are you manually doing it? No, I'm parked so it can aim better. But it's still, yeah, the gun's down. moving a bit. Turret's down. I don't think it is. It's still it shooting is. At Stop shooting at me. Well, I must be trying to shoot the one on the far side then. And you gotta be careful because you, you would have been hitting the battery a bit then. Ow, oh, there's a fire flag coming in. AI control modules down. Wonderful. There's a fire flag coming in. I don't know how much ammo Inventory I've got. Left. Full. The other turret's down. No, it's shooting your rover! Well, I can't do anything about that. You can though! It's also gonna crash! Ugh. It just crashed into your rover. No, it didn't. Did it? It did. Oh, no, we're not gonna move, otherwise my guns are gonna shoot your rover trying to shoot the drone. No! Stop shooting you with this rover! Oh, there's another drone. That one doesn't have any... The Firefly doesn't have any gun left. Yeah, it's not shooting it. It's shooting at the space loss. Yeah. Uh, uh. This is not going well. Ow! No, I'm out of ammo! Ah. I'm gonna have to, no, I'm, I'm gonna have to run away. 
I'm out of ammo. <laughs> um, honestly, we might have to abandon your rover and just run. Unless you think you can... Unless you can reverse up to my ro rover and connect up... You just ran me over. What? And connect up to it with your connector so it's got power uh, and then both can shoot. Yeah, but I'm out of ammo. Um, where is your connector? Yeah, but my gu mine isn't out of ammo. So did you respawn? What, there, yes, and then you ran me over. No, I mean after that. No, because uh, I was... It's just a very difficult to do this while under fire. I know. I know, but I think it's the only option. I was going to say, if we've got rifles, we could just shoot the... If you it is really get... hard to do so with our terrible jetpack, jetpacks. I was going to say... I'm... No, it's shooting you. Try to get the drone to shoot me so you can get your stuff. It seems to want to shoot you. Honestly, I might get out on foot and just shoot the drone. Yeah, do it. Hang on, if it's trying to shoot me, that's a perfect opportunity for you to hook up to my rover. Well, move away from the... Never mind. <laughs> yeah, I'm moving away, I'm moving away, I'm moving away. Moving away. The other one crashed. I was not anticipating having to do a rescue mission. <laughs> Ugh. Things to check before we leave. Power. Oh, <laughs> Rove is not aligned. <laughs> I'm just loving the view that I've got right now. <laughs> I've just gone third person and I'm just watching myself be chased by oh. a line of bullets. Have you hooked up? Yes. We've got power. Guns are turning. Good. Yes. Yes. It's working. <laughs> yes. All right. Now let's try and get over to that base and see if we can cobble together a connector and recharge our rovers. Um, am I driving? Yeah, probably. Oh yeah, you're gonna have to uh, turn off your wheels propulsion? Is that what's gonna stop me driving? No, what's gonna... I need to turn off my wheels friction, probably. Yeah. Alright, drive away. Oh wait, I'm driving. No! Why am I the parent? Do I need to hop back in? Get out, hop back in. Nope, you're in control. You out of the cockpit? Are you in? Okay, I'm in the cockpit. I mean, I can always I'm just sit in the passenger seat on the side. Oh yeah, that'll make it easier. Oh, we've only got, yeah, not much power. Yep, just go, you're going the wrong way. No, I'm not. Guess you are. Home, no, we're going to the, to the base there, the, but, gonna but be able, we, it's we, got a battery that's intact. But, okay. <laughs> I didn't think we'd be able to make it home with this much power. Also, isn't there... There's definitely a guard at the far side of the base. Judging I've how taken it out. Turret. Oh, good. Wait, so the base isn't owned by anyone? Oh, Correct. The remote's probably still... No, it's still... The antenna is Oh, so the no, but the, probably still. but the... So the AI control module's down, but the base is not owned by us. Oh, yeah, my gun's in. Trust. So you might want to just deactivate your gun's targeting for stuff. Yeah. Or at least make them on only weapons. Or pro uh, only propulsion. I've, I've got them on propulsion, yeah. They're... But yeah, basically I, I took it out enough that it's not going to spawn new drone. It's not going to call in new help. I was so confused then. I was like, what's going on? Because it, it didn't look like I didn't hear the doo sound of running out of power. The vehicle. Oh, this Ooh. is going to be... Yeah, that, I realised the problem with... You might want to stop. Yep. Be fine. No wonder you keep breaking your chin guard. Hey, there's also a turret that's just floating. Yep. We didn't destroy the turret, we destroyed the block it was attached to. And we didn't die. Guess how much health I was on when the drone was yeah, shooting me and you were trying to hook up the connectors. One. Oh, you might want to yeah. rebuild it and grab the ammo. Yeah. I suppose this is a victory? Inventory yeah. Full. Uh, <laughs> swords. Alright, so we're, what we need to do is figure out if we've got enough stuff to build a, con a connector. We may be best off building a hinge and then a small yeah, grid connector. Yeah, a small grid one. Yeah. Here's probably the best spot. Yeah, just off the side here. Oh, uh, hinge connector. Fuel low. Mm, okay. It's cheaper. We're just we're literally just yeah. talking about that. Fuel critical. <laughs> you even agreed. <laughs> probably need to do a hinge lockers. Nope, too late. <laughs> we, we came out of that better than we should have. <laughs> well, yes. I mean, Given we were out of power at the start of the battle, or I was. 
I'm still amazed I haven't died yet, although I was responsible for one of yours. <laughs> Vehicular manslaughter. Alright, you can detach me. Actually, you've got a survival kit on this, haven't you? Why didn't no. you spawn there? No, I did not. Haven't? You oh, are the I've only one. one. Oh. I thought you'd put one on there. No! I said I wasn't going to! You don't listen! You're cap hack number two! <laughs> oh. Uh, how am I going to connect you up to get power? What, do I have to push you? Well, what I was thinking <laughs> is maybe transfer a little bit of power to me if so I can just get Ooh, there. Let's see how this works. But if you're... But what I was thinking is because your power is low, maybe you should charge up a little bit first. Actually, that could work. I could basically do you like um, a hockey puck. I could set you up to drift towards the connector. I think what might be better is just a little landing gear on the front of yours and push me backwards into the connector. Oh, so like um, where my beans are, I can just stick a... Yeah, just stick a line of blocks and then a landing gear and lock onto me and I'll zero can friction and then you can control me. I love that we had to do this. This is Space Engineers <laughs> at its finest, honestly. <laughs> this is where Space Engineers is good. Doing Engineering your way around these sort of weird problems. I'm locked. Okay, my friction's at zero. This is the... Why oh, is the gun pointing at me? No, I'm spinning. <laughs> You're controlling it, aren't you? No, it's off. Oh, so the... It's just swinging. It's really spinning around. Um... This is... Oh, this is tranky. Uh, I might need to release you. Are you... Can you lock? Because you don't need no. power to lock. You're not no, close enough. I can't lock because I'm not aligned. Oh, we've got to tilt you upwards. Uh, no, no, you've got to line me up straight. There we go. No, stop, stop, oh. stop, stop. Oh. Push me back, push me back, push me back. All I did was literally just crash into you without locking. Um, um lock on. No, you got to straighten me up a bit. Gotta like, hang on. You got to... No, you... that's the wrong way. Hang on. Reverse. Oh, it doesn't help I'm attached to you at a slight angle now. Mm-hmm. That's a worse not angle than before. At all. I'm also running out of power. Oh dear. you got to hook me up before you run out. <laughs> yeah. So then I can move you and hook you up. No, I'm going to have enough. It's just... Locked. Yes! Alright. Still up five minutes. Mm. Batteries on recharge. See, now, as much as I know you just like them, I could actually fit solar panels on the side of my rover. <laughs> oh no, I they're fine on the... rovers. I just can't back puts them on things that fly. <laughs> they are counterproductive on things that fly. Yeah, they tend to just make you heavier. Um... Yep. But yes, you you do make a good point. We do have enough um, solar do... cells here to put solar panels on our rovers to limp and... our way home. And it do... may actually not be a bad idea. <laughs> Assuming the sun will last that long, which it looks like it may not. Uh, actually, we're not getting any solar power at the moment because of the gas giant. Oh, the stupid gas... Who put that there, anyway? <laughs> uh, do you want to hook up to this connector? Uh, yep. I like how it's like, we've got plenty of resources, and then we run out of power. <laughs> there you go. Well, that was... I mean, this adventure has been... Um, Adventurous. <laughs> well, arguably successful, because we did take out the two bases. Um... Yeah, oh, I need to set my battery on uh, oh, recharge. If we, both, if we both have our batteries on recharge, they won't. Uh, Correct. They'll just steal from the base. Each other. Yep. <laughs> I just had a really dumb thought. What? Well, with with Why? the right setup, we could just drive home with these batteries attached to us. Mm. Totally Probably work. Would... I mean, heck, you always take the entire base. Um. <laughs> well, it's just the... Just having the batteries will be... Rare, should be okay to drive with. Mm. I'm going to give it a crack. Because there are two batteries on here, so we can both do that. Mm. Like if you set up to try and grab this one, and I'll set up to try and grab the other one, now that we both probably have enough charge to move around a little bit, um, we should be safe to re like readjust our connector positions and things. I wonder if I can replace my wheel oh, and yeah. repair my other damaged ones because I can't steer on the front end at the moment. So I've Maybe taken so you much damage. should put a survival kit on that once we get back to base. 
<laughs> no, it'll ruin its lines. But I wasn't expecting you to spawn on my two. You just don't want to be blamed for me getting squashed. Well, <laughs> it was a combat scenario, so I think people will be fairly lenient to me. <laughs> so next time we head out for an adventure, I need to literally fill my rover with ammo until it's completely Inventory full. Inventory full. I thought you were doing that already. No, I wasn't. I was putting enough to fill the guns in like 30, 40 extra cases. Apparently that is not enough. You were being conservative. No. All right, um, I'm hooked up to this battery, so do you want to move your connector? Uh, what am I doing? Have a look what I've done on this side. Yeah, that works. So that I can drive with the battery attached. That way we can bring the battery back home. So if you do the same uh, on the other end, you can drive the other battery back home and we can leave now rather than waiting till our batteries charge. Sounds incredibly dangerous still. <laughs> yeah. But I figured since there were two batteries, it made sense to do it. Oh, and now I've got to turn my battery off recharge. There we go. I've got a hinge. I've got a battery spoiler. Perfect. I mean, we wanted more downforce. I'm more concerned it's going to make me back heavy. Um, <laughs> it's going to make you very back heavy. Mmm. Whoa, why is it shaking? Because uh, I'm using hinge limits to adjust its position. Whoa. Terrifying. It's not how, and it's not particularly happy what about it. What is weird is the the gun's not moving, but everything the like the road tire's not moving, but everything else around it is shaking. <laughs> it's very disturbing. I think I might take a breaking talk. We're so almost ready to make this epic journey back home. Whoa! Okay, I'm not staying anywhere near that. <laughs> okay, start, it's done now. It's done. I might start driving back. Uh, hang on, wait, 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 wait. Uh, one of my oxygen bottles ran I out. Need, I need parts from your... that you've collected for my wheel. Yeah. I haven't got any on my person. Amazing. Okay, my wheels are done. I'm good to go. Yep, let's get out of here. Yep, <laughs> before it gets too dark. <laughs> I mean, did this go better or worse than the last time? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'd say it went better for me and worse for you compared to last time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, I might actually need my lights now. Actually, were you... Oh, because you're running your lights the entire time. That probably doesn't help. It doesn't help. Especially no. when it was daylight, although it's getting dark. Yeah, we might... We got seven Ks to travel in the dark. Mm. I'm uh, not sure don't. how our thrusters are going to handle having these large subgrids. I wasn't going to try that. <laughs> it's safer to just... I'm tempted to, just to expedite our return I'm, home. I'm concerned you're just going to backflip, because the way you were shaking earlier has got me worried. <laughs> they might just... Um, are those search ships crashing into each other? They're awfully close. They are very close to each other. Also, this looks like a very steep hill. It does. Especially with us now being back heavy. Yep. That's why I'm driving up on my front wheels. <laughs> Using my gyro mm. to keep them on the ground. Yeah. Uh, is there a crate on the other side? Yep. Yeah. Okay, I might want to avoid that. Well, this was certainly an adventure. It was. I'm a bit concerned if this is how things go when we're driving, how's it going to go when we're flying? <laughs> that, that's precisely why I'm I'm all, all for continuing to drive. Because I think flying it'll just be like, blam, done. Oh, I have to make another one. Yeah, we'll either blam with one or blam we've died. <laughs> yeah, yeah. There's no, there's no grey zone with it. It's all dead or one. Especially have a fighter with like a little decoy dropper thing, so the turrets on the base would shoot them while you deal with the drone. Yeah. Just because they're they're closer. Oh, that's a big cliff. Mm. That's a reckless driver. <laughs> you mean really? glider? Uh, I was going to wait for you to say something about me being a reckless flyer. <laughs> I mean, you are. It was so obvious I had to just let it slide. Dang it. Again? What is with these assert bases constantly? Stop criticising my coding! Not. I'm just pointing out that with how often they talk about increasing drone patrols. Yeah, it hasn't I'm happened. 
I'm surprised there's any airspace left. Hmm. I guess it's still technically airspace even if there's no air. Moon space doesn't sound right. <laughs> space space. Yeah, I don't know what it. Yeah. I don't know what it. Yeah. Oh mm -hmm. no, my hinge has been damaged. <laughs> uh oh. Uh no, I think my battery's damaged as well. Dang it! Oh, did you just smash your new battery? Yeah, battery's dead. Oh. Uh... Well, I guess I'm dropping it. Well, I mean, it served its purpose of giving me more power. Mine's almost fully depleted. It's only got 45 seconds and it'll be fully depleted. But I did get 83% charge on my internal batteries. Uh, so that's I suppose, pretty good. I suppose I can just drop it with my connector. Sorry, you served me well. I'm just leaving you here in the... <laughs> right. Yeah, I'm just waiting for mine to die so then I can switch. Yeah, I suppose I should ditch mine as well, shouldn't I? Like, w when... Do we really Resources-wise, there's not a lot there. How many batteries there. have we got on the base? Uh, two. I think Three. maybe we should, maybe we should put them under, like if we've got them under the floor and like spread them out so that's likely to get shot up. Yeah, yeah. Uh, well, I'm I'm about to build our generator room. Ooh. That was my plan. Build hydrogen engine mm. and all that. Can we just spawn? Uh, there's two of set observers now. There were two before. Hmm. Must be my game just lagging a little bit. Bye bye. My bad battery. We don't need you. You served me well, though. Okay. Oh! I just Will hit the bottom the of my rover or something. Oh. Uh, did you explode? Nope. Mm. So you may I, have just just... I just you... heard an explosion. Yeah, yeah I accidentally got... hit my connector button. What? How would that cause an explosion? Because oh, I dropped... dropped the... <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I'm thinking you're not connected to anything because obviously I'm not anymore. <laughs> yeah, because I detached my hinge rather than detaching the connector. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna glide back to our base. <laughs> uh, I, I suppose I'll get ready to repair my garage then. <laughs> wow. Well, <laughs> I'm pretty no, no, sure. Own you, it. I'm pretty, own it. <laughs> As I'm pretty sure we're approaching from that direction, and it's <laughs> probably what you're going to hit. Keep up with this naysaying, and I'll have to start doing stunts just to show that I know what I'm doing. Just do front flips. Ah, well, I've already done a bunch of front flips. Mainly trying to get out of craters. <sighs> Home crater, coming down. Come on, you go. need to make a flying thing. You are basically flying now anyway. <laughs> no, I like, I like having a rover that can fly. Isn't this... Isn't this like the argument for flying cars? It's just a plane, basically. <laughs> but this isn't. Well, I mean, it hasn't got forwards for us, but otherwise it pretty much is. If this was a plane, this would be dead. Mm, potentially. <laughs> it ran out oh, of power. Yeah. <laughs> it would have been oh, dead. Oh, yeah. Uh, is there any drone debris or damage from the thing that went to shoot our base? Um, no. Uh, is the searchlight? Thing on the hill still there? It must have shot something. Well, I can't see its board. searchlight actually. It might have been destroyed. Oh. No! Not our unnamed searchlight. Oh yeah, it's proper destroyed. Sounds like it did its job though. Yeah. So we just have to sacrifice a searchlight every so often. Uh, I think the battery's intact though. Yeah, the battery here is intact. Is the turret? No, the turret's probably not. Intact. No, no, nothing else is intact. Yeah. <laughs> Everything on top <laughs> is not there. I am a kilometre and a half away. Alright. Come on, jump over the crater edge. You know you want to. Not really. Go on, full speed! Power! The good news is, we have significantly cut down the number of assert bases around us. Hmm. As long as we stick around our base for a bit, we shouldn't have any more, hopefully. Yeah, We're not which... going on epic adventures that annoy them. It means we could start thinking about doing a couple of fighter designs. Oh, Do here he comes. Things. He's doing the uh... jump. Oh, and he's flying. <laughs> Taking it much more gingerly than last time. Yes. Just enough <laughs> to clear the... Your little doom crater that you got stuck in. Mm. Much better. Nice. 
Uh, so yeah, do you want to next time do some fighter building and designing? Sounds like it could be interesting. Yeah, I'm thinking if we both try and design a bit of a fighter, we'll try and we'll see if we can capture one of these, or at least go and attack one of these cargo ships that's flying overhead. If we manage to get a couple of successful designs that are hopefully printable, then maybe we can have a backup each. Hmm. That would be handy when we inevitably die. Hmm, indeed. <laughs> so yeah, that's it. Next week. Next week we will be attempting some fightering unless a cert decides to attack us at our base. This is all that and plenty more to come. And we will see you then. Bye.